COPD is a very disabling disease. I've been diagnosed with it for 17 years now. And as the years have gone on, the symptoms obviously get more and more and more. You become, your chest infections last longer. Um, you just become more unwell. It's not a nice disease to have. COPD affects me in a variety of ways. I get out of breath very quickly. Uh, and strange things like, tying my shoelaces or putting on my socks, I can get out of breath within a couple of seconds. If I walk any distance, I've got to stop after, you know, 15 or 20 yards. I just get out of breath so easily and it's, it's frustrating, um, slightly worrying, um, but like everybody else in the choir, we try not to let it rule our lives, uh, but it, we know about it, it's there. The self-management I found very helpful. The deep breathing, definitely. It takes the stress away. When you start to feel short of wind, you don't panic. You just breathe deeply. You sleep better. Your, your whole being feels better because you feel better. It's not just the COPD that's being treated. It's the person as well as the, the disease. Hello, I'm Maureen Watt. I'm a member of the Scottish Parliament and Minister for Public Health in the Scottish Government and I was diagnosed with asthma in my 20s. As you have seen from this film, many thousands of people of all ages in Scotland and the UK are living with COPD or asthma every day. The Scottish Government funded the My Lungs My Life website to help all these people and their families to understand their condition and to become equal partners in their care by using supportive self-management tips and advice. Using self-management and working alongside all of the respiratory health care professionals will help you make the choices about your COPD or asthma, reduce the risk of our exacerbations or attacks by knowing the early warning signs and what to do, get to know all of the resources in your area and how they can help you manage better. The My Lungs, My Life website is free to use. It has no advertising or those annoying pop-ups and you don't have to log in. It has been written by respiratory specialists from across NHS Scotland and it has been independently reviewed by respiratory clinicians and people like you and me who are living with COPD and asthma. Chest, Heart and Stroke Scotland has been commissioned to develop My Lungs, My Life in partnership with the University of Edinburgh, the British Lung Foundation and NHS Scotland through respiratory specialists and managed clinical networks. Oh, 